Medigal Youth Development Services is obviously a voluntary organisation. It's been running for about 15 years um, and I've been the manager for about the last 10 years. Um, we do lots of different things. Um, we work with young people 0 to 25 years old to provide a range of recreational, social, support and formal learning opportunities. Um, we're open full time and we do various things like sporting activities, free girls swimming projects, um, young parents support groups, we do free training and employability schemes for young people who are, who are not in employment, education or training. Well the skate park idea has been on the horizon for quite a few years I think. Um, it originally started with um, one of the young boys coming and saying I'd really like a skate park and at the time we were looking at an area um, at, at Komori Woodlands to develop it um, and the, the excitement of the young people, they'd come along with drawings of what they wanted and stuff like that but the site wasn't appropriate and it just never, never took to doing anything. Getting a location for the state skate park was very difficult to start with because sites that are big enough tended to be taken up and there just wasn't a lot of space left for anything. So the site that we found through the help of maids um, is both big enough and available for a skate park, which is really lucky. It's also right next door, which is good. And then the boys themselves set a petition up online. I think it's got 25,000 signatures or something from people all over the world, which is amazing that they've done that off their own back. Yeah, I think a petition was a good idea for that because a petition not only allowed people to sign it, but people could comment as well. And then that was just like once we told our friends they could sign it, they signed it, then they told their friends, and then it just snowball yeah. effect got bigger and bigger. And then they also had a campaign locally in the newspaper. Um, and it would always been on Medigal Youth Development Services' agenda to do the skate park. And then when we seen their campaign, we sort of all got together. And it just so happened at that time that the property next door became available. It's quite achieving when you work with young people who are struggling academically or in education and, and it's maybe took a year or two to support them into employment and stuff like that but you see them now in a positive destination um, so th I mean there's just lots of different things even like the young parents for you know coming you know that we've just had one her son's gone to school and she was with us from pre-birth and you know she came in the other day and said that's him now at school and was just delighted so just different things like that. Fiona Kalachi as manager underestimates what difference she's made to the community. She is all invasive. She takes on every role by herself and, and forges away. Um, the, the impact on the community at large has been incredible. To a lot of young lives it's been transformational.